Hello YouTube, this is Gajara here and we are going to try something different today. Instead of a review, I am going to do a build dial and I'm going to do this in phases. So what I'm going to do is show you where I'm at right now and post this and if you wish to follow I will have links into a separate folder that you can sit there and look at as everything is posted. What you see here is going to be based inspired from the game Skyrim um, building the Hearthfire Lakeview Manor style home Lakeview, Helldarken, Winstead, whichever you wish to call it but here we have the main hall as you can see I have already carved out the floors and park, pockmarked the walls and cut out the lower level floors uh, doors, I'm sorry, the lower level doors, I really am really nervous now because this is a whole brand new project for me. This is the first time I am working with this foam board. The insulation foam I get from, you get from Home Depot is what I'm using here. This is a huge project that I am working on. It is going to be done in phases. The first part I'm making here is the main hall. And... It will have the stairs going up in the background, the second level, and then the door over here. And I will have the side walls coming up on the side, um, each side here that will lead into the other wings of the house. I will also be putting together the furniture and the wall decorations. I have plans for those. I've been discussing with my roommate we've been brainstorming on this plan so this is what I got right now and as I said I did carve out the floors while it is not a perfect duplicate of what you see in the game it is a very good representation and I did pockmark the walls to give it some texture I also plan to put up the wood beams I have right here the start of, it's already been carved and sealed, and these will just be placed right along the side of the walls here. Now you'll note that I did veer from most traditional methods in that instead of putting this wall on top of the floor, as most everybody does, you can see I've already got the magnets in place. Instead of putting it on top like most people do, I had it set on the side. And the purpose for this is, like I said, this is actually a very big project that I'm going to do in phases. The next phase, as um, you will see, the next phase is I will start working on the wings, which will go behind the doors. And we're talking... If you're familiar with the Hearthfire add-on to Skyrim, we're talking the library, the armory, the kitchen, etc. And those will be both separate units in that they can separate and you could use those to take photographs as well as background for the, in, for the doorway itself so that when the doors are open you can actually see into the next room. Um, as I said, it will also have the second level. Once that's done, I will carve in the next door that goes up here. Um, one of the things that you can see as I've been working on this is I have already started working on some of the furniture. This here is going to be the alchemy table but I do plan on redoing that all over again. That is a whole separate video. So we'll get to that when that particular area comes in. But yes, this is going to be a huge project. It is also my first project using the insulation boards from Home Depot so I think I may have overextended myself but you know what I'm gonna have fun doing this that's the whole point so be sure to like and subscribe follow along as these things get posted as I get started on the next phase of the projects as I get start finish up with certain parts I will post videos so that you can see what's going on follow along subscribe like comment the whole bit, and we'll see how this goes. 
This is Gajar from Nerdtopia, and we're saying thank you for viewing this video. Have a good day.